much cost. We don't know. We don't know. My people, everybody is asking questions. What is the problem? And these are affecting us seriously. If closing of the border is what the Federal Republic of Nigeria is thinking that the best way, to me, the economy are going down. The economy of this nation is going down because you cannot just close border. You don't talk to this involved. Take for example, nobody is coming to Nigeria again to buy anything. And if other countries cannot come to their own country and compensate you, we travel to China, we travel to Turkey, we travel to uh, Taiwan, we travel to even the London America. That is, if America come up on today and on day today and say they don't want anybody to come to the America, I give you this one, America will. And Nigeria in Africa is a giant. It's, not, it's like number one. No matter the kind of the problem we are having, I don't think closing the border is the best. You can only close border when there is an election or two. But call for me back there. We are not talking where that one is a forgotten issue. Nobody is thinking of that back. But I'm telling you closing of this border, our economy is going down. I am appealing to our president, no matter whatever, there is no way we will cut off relationship with uh, our country, our other countries, or whatever. Very important. If you will say it, you don't need the visa in your house. And you stay in your house for one week, no visitor, nobody. It there a compound. One month, no, nobody. Two months, nobody. You will first to ask your question, your, your, your self question. What is happening? If you are family, your wife will ask you, Daddy, what is happening? Nobody is coming to our house again. The mineral that are put in the fridge are stayed for almost six months. And it's 12, and that 12 is there. You can rule out this important to you most. So, closing of the border is not the best. I am, as I repeat, I am, I am appealing to our commander in chief, Buhari, the Ashram Prince. Please look into this point. I thank God that they are set up economic or whatever, they, whatever. They will advise him. You can close border, but you cannot blame the president. I know this Boko Haram bandit, many things have been hard men at it, according to them. And it says like that. You may read what it says. And the population, because I'm aware that what we call a uh, was. If it may be looked at the other countries that come with ECOWAS are not cooperating, you may read to this. But I am appealing to you because of the promises, because of the masses. People are suffering now. I am not encouraging that the, what they call it is a contraband, um, uh, rice, um, uh, what, uh, the rice, talking. To me, rice and talking is not the issue. We are not dealing on talking, we are not dealing on rice. We are dealing on spare parts. Spare parts have nothing to do with the talking. And nobody can smuggle uh, spare parts. What I think the federal government can do today, 
and they could remove all the customs and the whatever and make a new church. If they stop rice and they stop talking, I am telling you without rice, without talking, I will make a problem. But we're having serious like we did not stay fast, iron. It has nothing to do with it. It has nothing to do with, uh, uh, with uh, uh, rice. We have rice in this country. If it's our problem is rice, we will manage what we have. I'm feeling this is the third one that government should look into this. We are selling stay fast. As the president of what of the past national association, if you I can take you around now, for the one month and three weeks or two months, you can see some trailers packed after loading to move either to China, uh, either to China, to Ghana, to Ghana, to Africa, Sierra Leone. I am telling you, this is this is we are supposed to be poor. Of all this country coming to Nigeria to buy all this rice, we are traveling to China. And the ones you said we don't need them again, I am telling you, at the end of the day, we will regret. It's not, it's not, you can, somebody may say, uh, God did do this because of this. But it's good to think well, digest it well before action. I'm afraid to feel like It's important. People are suffering now. Then the Lord in question. You asked of the Lord in question. Yes. I don't know what is happening. The Lagos State government are trying. But you can see. Either the force is for the China. And the way I'm saying it, the force is from the company and not from the state. How can you then balloon everywhere? If you want to concentrate on this thing, do it. Go down that bridge now. From under the bridge, people that are going to satellite, no road. For two weeks now, the other side of the road, you cannot. They're not even thinking of the people going to satellite. Is that the way to do things? You see, are they expecting the the governor to be coming here every morning when he has awarded the contract to them. So the port is from the company. It's not the, from the state or the federal. But the minister of what's a housing should do what? And visit the site and uh, direct them what they should do. Because people are suffering. As I'm talking to you, Nigeria, what to do? But it's coming to buy anything again. At least part of water. Internally. Internally. What about the border? So I'm um, appealing to state government. Three months ago, in press conference, I called someone to come up with a evaluation. Pending what money will be available for this event contract for this year? And he tried. And after that financial measure, I have not seen that they have ordered the contract, but the company, I know they are not doing what we are expecting. I expect it. So the commissioner of works for the government should visit the sites and tell them or direct them, or correct them. That's not the way. You can't just model everything together and without proper arrangement and people will talk. People, sorry, people will be suffering. It's not that I can't say that. So we are going to record that.